Good morning from beautiful Dominica. And we have a problem already. Hello, my name is Rokia, also known as Miss Queen Roll. I am a full-time entrepreneur working as a brand strategist, part-time digital content creator, and yeah, we're already stuck in Dominica. We haven't been on this tour but like 10 minutes. So apparently, the van has overheated, and we were on our way to the rainforest, and we had to stop in the middle. So we are waiting patiently for another tour bus to come pick us up because this one is smoking and break broken down. Well, in the mist, we can just look at this beautiful view that is that is behind me. They got the mountains and somewhat of a rainforest. This is really interesting. And I was just saying to my friend that this has never happened to me before because they were talking about uh, taking a tour from the ship because just in case something like this happens or you get a flat tire, the ship will wait for you. But thankfully this happened in the beginning of the tour, so it's early morning, we're good. But I was just saying that, that nothing has ever happened to me. Well, here it is. So while we're waiting, some fun facts about Dominica. The island holds only 71,000 people. 3,000 of those people are indigenous that live in the northeast area, he said. Many years of independence from Britain, I think 65, I remember, if I remember correctly. Kids go to primary school till about 9, and then they go to high school, and then from there they graduate until... They go until about 16, he said. Very interesting. Trade with we another bus. Another bus. Kulam, we have choices to do a foreign language. Other term was French or Spanish. But this island is situated between two French islands, Martinique to the south and Guadeloupe to the north. She was the oldest lady on the island. She lived to be 128 years old. They made a statue of her. Not all that madness is taken care of. We have, I guess this is officially our first stop. We're near the waterfalls, like you can hike your way up 12 minutes, pay $5 to hike your way up 12 minutes to the waterfalls. I've seen many waterfalls, I'm not going to do that. But this is a rest stop to get, go to the washroom or bathroom and do a little shops here, shopping here. But the view is gorgeous once you turn around. Oh, uh, correction. He said, I don't know which one's right because the first guy said something, this guy saying something different, but this guy says that the kids go to elementary or primary school until about 11 years old, and then they go to high school. And they stay in high school about four years until they graduate around 16, 17. And then they go to university for about two years. So we made it to the sulfur area. You will know where, you're, where you are because it stinks. It really stinks here. Oh, it's it smells it smells so badly. Ugh. I just left the boat after the hurricane. <laughs> oh well. Over a hundred and fifty years old. Tree is over a hundred years old. The bike, hundred and fifty years old. Wow. Only elephant look at the size. Look at the size of that peanut. Yeah. Good gracious! In the botanical gardens, this is their botanical garden. In the peanut, <laughs> peanut tree. Like, can you eat these? Only elephants. Oh, only elephants. Are you serious? Yeah. <laughs> only elephants. <laughs> My gosh. We have now reached the most southern point of the island. I think you can see Martinique somewhere, but before we try to see that, look at this view of the city. You can't get much gorgeous in this. My goodness. And that's just, well, that's not our ship. I think our ship is over there, yeah. Our ship is that way. This, this is our where's, where's Martinique? You said no, this, no, the, is on that side. Uh, yeah. Okay. When we go to the point, you can see Martinique. Oh. And the Atlantic is just 10, 15 feet apart. Oh, nice. 
Is that the cemetery? What is that? Yeah, it's, 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 a that's the Catholic side of the cemetery. Okay. All this is part of the botanical garden. Our state building is this white one of oh, the cemetery. Oh, this one, the state building, okay. It's one of the largest hotels in the city, Portia. This is where we play cricket, soccer. Oh, there's the cricket, the, son, yeah, and in soccer. And the stadium, we play both cricket and soccer in. It was built yeah. by the Chinese also. Oh, nice. It's two tourist buildings, that's the government has their offices. Mm. The black roof, which mm. is Catholic, home for the ages. The black roof yeah, means? The square, same with the um, oh, solar thing on it here. Where the soldiers on the building? Yes, this is a home for the ages, run by the Catholics. Oh, the Black Rose mainly run by the Catholics, nice. Another fun fact he just told me, there is no international airport to Dominica. You actually have to catch, you have to catch uh, one from the neighboring island, probably like Martinique or St. Lucia, and then take a ferry over here, unfortunately. Didn't know that. It's too bad though because actually Dominica I would rather I would love to come back here. So far I'm liking it here. So this is the Methodist Cemetery, the oldest cemetery on the island, over 200 years old. Oldest, oh. oldest cemetery. So over 200 years old. Place, State Candy building. Here's a fort. But he just said that the pet, their current president is indigenous. So and he's a female. Interesting. Look at the city. It's, the yeah. Side. It's to, the city mimics New Orleans Bourbon Street. It has the Creole flavor. Oh, I should say French side. French side. Well, that concludes our tour. It was a pretty good one. I would have to say this one, I would rate it maybe four out of five and not even really the, um, the fact that we got stuck because they handled that really pretty quickly. It was just, uh, they need to have more tours where you can get out and do things, but most of the time we just we were in the vans. I don't know if that's supposed to be like that or what, but four out of five. He was nice and he was pretty detailed. So we're going to call it an end. Thank you so much for watching until now. I hope you subscribe. If not, please do. And if at the least, leave a thumbs up for the like. I appreciate it. I have one more country to visit before this week is over. So I hope you stick with me. Until then, bye.